Howdy do, my name's Amethyst, and we've had a few more LEGO sets for Disney and Marvel that have been revealed, and even though they're not my thing, I still think they're worth talking about. First up are the Disney Brickheads, which consist of three dual packs. The Villains pack, which includes Maleficent and Cruella de Vil, isn't that interesting, but I think it works as a crowd pleaser. Whilst the Princesses pack, which includes Moana and Merida, looks superior, mainly for its impressive recreation of a haku on Moana's head. But the Axiom pack, which includes wall -E and Eve, is officially the first ever Brickheads pack I'm eager to buy because it is a near-perfect translation of the Metal Power Couple. Now it's time to move on to Lego Marvel, who just unveiled the Star-Lord helmet, and it is a pretty impressive model capturing all the details pretty well. The only thing that weirds me out is the gap on top. I understand the exclusion of Star-Lord's hair, but it makes the set feel a little incomplete as a result. That's pretty much all I have to say about these sets. I know that none of them represent my personal preferences, but I do think they're all successful crowd pleasers, and the fact that there's a Brickheads pack worth purchasing is something to celebrate. Anyway, that's all for now. Tell me what you think of these sets in the comments below, and thanks for watching.